<laughs> I did not know I walked like this. Oh my god. Oh, that's amazing. Anyways, I've been wanting to do a Craft Hannah showcase for a while, but I wanted to do the more hype stuff first. Like, Terry Desen is a really popular one. Prawns, who I just deem to be broken. Which, I know it's not, but I love it. Also, someone told me Prawns was applied frustration. I need to go get that. I didn't know it had applied frustration. That's insane! Zulong. Zulong is a threat. We gotta be careful around Zulong. I think you go for Zip Zap. Which means... Oh. Oh, I didn't even give you an item. Oops. Oops, I forgot to give my Terry Destin an item. And his name is also gotten. Excuse me. Uh, I... Speaking of Terry Destin, I... Guess I go into it? I don't have a lot of options. I don't want to go into Imperial on a Zip Zap. That would be disastrous. No, they just go for T-Strike. This means that El Eber should KO me. No, never mind. That is a very weak Zulong. Let's just Hyper Sting, because this... Thunder... Oh. Oh, it's a noob. It's a noob. No wonder that it's a little. What the hell? Well, uh, one kill for Terry Descent, but I kind of... I want to use Craptana. Craptana's insane. I want to make use of Craptana. What's this supposed to do to me? It's gonna do something to me. I just don't know what the thing it's gonna do to me is gonna be. So, hmm. What little, little thing can you do to me? What's it gonna go for? Gnarly Gash. So, Gnarly Gash. Let's just stay in. Let's just stay in. It is faster. And it does KO. That was a, that was a misplay. Look, I'm just not super worried about how Vantic, okay? I'm sorry. I'm getting cocky. So we know it's faster. Actually, wait, how Vantic is faster than Terry Desen anyways. I'm a complete idiot. Like a complete idiot. Nice, sorry. Somehow Vantic got one shot. Not all of them do, but hey, you got to kill. Windrix, alright. Airblade or Brain Freeze? Uh, it could be any. I want to send in this, but if it's wise, Brain Freeze is going to 2-hit KO. Although, I do one-shot it with Razor Sharp, and we are faster. So let's just do it. Let's go into True Gambit. It's an aggressive swap. Like, really aggressive. Ooh, Airblade. It's not Glide. So then, Airblade said, alright. Airblade is viable, but I just don't like it. It's also faster. Why is it faster? Is it Boots? I should have clicked Drudge. I didn't think it would be faster. Windrix normally is slower. So that's either very nimble or... Wait, no, I'm very brawny. Oh, wait. That means it could be nimble. But even then, I don't like... I don't think nimble is very good. Uh... I'm gonna play a risky. I have Phage, not that I can live a jungle to do in the back. We're gonna go hard into Imperia. And if Imperia doesn't get one shot, I'm gonna be sad. Why are people running <laughs> Never use Toxic Tail. On a bar on a Boots Top Hab, you run Timber Frash, Jungle Jutsu, Barter, and B Poison. Poison is the move you click. You, will you Okay, it's not, it's not even Boots. It's not even Boots. Flinch? Yeah, the, the odds are just in my favor at this point. Sipping of Cap... Okay, buddy. You do you. Let's go for Fade Away and bring back in the True Gambit just so I can look at it more because I think it's pretty cool. A lot of people don't like True Gambit. Sharonix is actually good. Sharonix is broken. Dusk it. Go for Drudge. It's going to KO me. Yep. Uh, unfortunate. Oh, um, goodbye, True Gambit. You're cool. People really doubt the True Gambit. They said it wasn't good. They said that it was. They didn't. They that the typing was clunky. The stats were clunky. It doesn't have an amazing ability. I heard it has a pretty cool ability in doubles. I'm not sure about that. Anyways, on to the next one. No new Lumians here. Interesting. I forgot I don't want my Terry Descent. 
Dargo. Alright, is it a lead Dargo set or is it a Draco Beamer? It could be either. It could be either. Now, normally I zip zap against these things, but I don't have something faster, meaning it would get two layers of barbs. And I don't want that, so I'm just gonna Pharaoh Blast. It is plushy. It could be, again, it could be either set. Which one is it? Huh? Why Mega Punch? No one uses that. <laughs> The only time you use Mega Punch is on. Actually, Mega Punch is viable, but I only recommend it on Surrogate sets. Surrogate. You you could use it on Draco Beam Dorgo, but I'd rather just use Draco Beam, then Dark Search, then I guess Mud Spatter and Baffle, and then I guess if you want Scapegoat or Barbs or whatever. Not Mega Punch. I don't think Mega Punch is that great. Uh, Samarine. Okay, this is a threat. We gotta be careful around the Samarine. So, you're dead. You are not, though. And we have a Jolt Lumion. Alright, let's go into the Jolter, actually. Thunder Charm, there it is. Uh, they don't go for Sharpen, meaning we might live a Wave Wrecker. It obviously could be Cleft Plushy. Or, I guess, Volt Pearl. Volt Pearl's viable. I don't mind Volt Pearl. Let's see what one is it. Neither. Nice. Summary down. Got <laughs> Jolt. <laughs> Such a good move. It's just bullet punch scissor, man. You just spam it. It does a lot more damage than most. Like it's incredible. Seriously. People don't like it. I do. Faraglyph. This could be anything. It could be Idio. It could be not Idio. <gasps> I. <laughs> Let's just go for Thunderstrike. Psycho Blast. Okay, 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 okay. Ooh, that means I got good range of defense. Ooh. Barely out of Jolt range, I think. I think that's out of Jolt range. We're gonna stay in. This is a misplay, but I'm gonna do it. Oh, it killed. Okay, good. I wasn't sure. Like, 40 base power, 90 base power. I don't know. Whipple Drift. Ooh, Whipple Drift. I don't know if I died to a jet stream. We're gonna go for Jolt. This is gonna do a lot. Oh my god! Oh, they use Magnify. Uh oh. Uh oh. Jet stream kills me now. Do we get swept? No, we don't. We have an Imperial. Never mind. We don't get swept. Never mind. <laughs> that crit so mattered. I'm so sorry, man. But that's funny. I'm really sorry. That I don't like getting crits. It feels like I'm... It doesn't feel fair. I gotta use the true gambit. Die? Die. <laughs> Should've just done a shark. Also, that Zipsap did a ton of damage. That is offensive, Pyrolin. I'm sorry, true gambit. Uzi just killed everyone. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh my god. That's, that's, that's absurd. That's ridiculous. GG. I'm sorry. So, so, sorry about the crit. Uh, is that another gleaming Lavadius? All right, let's 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 see it. It is Luminati. All right, so we have two options here: set screens or dissipate. I think the best play by far is dissipate because if they flash and flee, I get the momentum because dissipate always goes last. There it is. But if they mega chomped, worse. Case scenario, we take damage and flinch. But if we just take Mega Chomp, we dissipate and bring an Uzi and start threatening everything. We, and I know they have a Himber, so we flash and flee. But I don't know if they brought Himber. A lot of our team friends Himber. Ooh, Swolder. Strategy would have actually been really fun, but that would have hit Luminami, actually. So we have a few options. I can send you in and start setting up, but I don't think that's good. Uzi probably makes the most sense. Probably just flash and flee, though. And then bring in someone. Because I know you have a Himber. I gotta be a little careful. They have a Himber. And if they stay in, I'm just gonna assume they don't have the Himber. Or they just desperately wanna poison me. And they could still have Himber. But a lot of our team deals with Himber, so they might. I feel like it's reasonable if they didn't bring it. But they could have. They did bring it. Alright. Himber. And now we get to switch out into. You could get a nice little KO. Now is it enough, though? 
I'm gonna play risky. Bad play, I know, but it's funny. No, it's not, but I'm go going for it. I think Razor Slash will give me that option for a crit. Okay, they just switch. Luminami? Luminami. Alright. How much does this do? It does... Not much. Alright, let's set up one Drudge. I assume Flash and Flea may be Wave Wrecker. Which doesn't really do much. It could be a range set. Alright. So they get all their health back. We get a Drudge up, though. Ooh, that did a lot. Yeah. We're not good on the range defense. At all. We're not very range bulky. We gotta be a little careful with Craptana. Which is why I kinda want screens up. But I don't have Persistence. And I didn't feel like setting screens up there. Ooh, Swolder. So you're gonna poison me. Let's go for Razor Slash. We obviously don't one-shot you. Swolder's got good melee bulk, and I assume this is bulky. There's the crit. Alright, yeah, we didn't kill it. Bane. Oh, I'm weak to that. I I don't know how I forgot that. Oh, no! The poison pretty much seals it. Yup. Damn. I forgot. I forgot about Baneful Bass. I don't know why I'm so stupid. I just don't fight Swolders with Baneful Bass very often. Not all of them use it. Oh, uh, I feel so dumb. I feel really dumb. Why just I get outsped? Like, what if it's offensive sorter? Although I feel like offensive sorter would have done more damage. I feel. I fe it should do more damage, right? Let's just go for stratagem. I don't know how much this will do to whatever the switch in is. Or they decide to sack sorter, which I guess is fine. Also, for those of you wondering where my Cleone showcase will be. I don't know either. <laughs> I don't know. Himber. That's a really bold switch. Himber. That looks barely not a two hit KO. So damage range. Damage range. Oh, crit. Oops. Well, I got a lot of crit. I mean, Razor Slash has the higher crit chance. I think the Baneful Mass Poison. That one matters. It's fine. I, 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 I. And there's a chance it didn't matter, anyways. Oh, wait, they just go back into this. What set is this? It is slower. I was worried about Boot Swolder. I love Boot Swolder. It is such a fun set. Good is... Uh, <laughs> not with that energy stat, no. Pop Tab. We do have Imperior. Let's finally use Resentful. When was the last time we made real use out of Resentful? Actually, I it was literally yesterday. When the phase not flash and fleet me. I feel like I haven't been doing it as much. I've been using Imperium more for its own merits. Which is actually really funny. Because that's not how you use Imperium. You use it like that. And maybe more. Maybe. So, who do they have? Luminami is potential. Let's bring in Phage Knot then. They only have two left. One of them is Luminami. Is Himber? No, Himber's dead. So, we're gonna go for Key Strike. They stay in. Alright, looks like they're out of options. I think their last Lumia needs to set up or something to have a shot. Craptana, you did fun there. That was a huge hit on Swolder. Novadius is last. Yeah, exactly. This is why they didn't hard switch into it. If they hard switched, they threw. But now, we could lose, but I think T-Strike and the Jolt KOs. Which is quite the sentence. Oh, it's range. Ooh. Ooh. They could prevent a critical hit. But this means they don't get to set up, meaning Deladrix always kills. But who needs Deladrix when you have broken Jolt? Genuinely, I think Jolt is all... I used to think it was bad. Then I thought it was amazing. Now I think it might be broken. <laughs> it's like, it really is just Bullet Punch Scissor. Anyways, that's done. Craptana, good.